don't know about you, it seems to be ages since we've had a update and um, there's finally one come out um, now, 17th of April this one is. This is called Flashback, so it's introducing, no they're re, well, they're putting three um, old events out, the 500 which was the Aston Martin GTE. Lines of Leipzig and Ride the Storm also, so you've got the Porsche 918 YSAC package and the Huracan, Lambo Huracan. Uh, you can win all these cars uh, and a hoard of gold. Believe that as much as you like. But so if you haven't won any of them free cars, or which you, you know all of them, perhaps you can win all of those cars. Looks like one one makes his way into the real racing free goes with an all new eight day special event. So it's an eight day um, like the old fashioned type of special event if you like for that race now so that looks like that's going to be open already that's always going to be a really good car win that's going to be well, actually they're all going to be quite expensive aren't they that um the 500 that was over about i think that was over about 10 or 12 days that was a, i think it might have been 12 days that was a really long series that one <clears throat> so if you um, haven't won any of these cars you're going to be very busy over the next month or so by look at this uh, Koenig 6 they're all brilliant cars and I would think this might even be the best Koenig 6 yet. It's definitely going to be as, about the same or maybe better than the Agera R and the Regera I would think. Unleash the Beast, Legendary Godzilla, Skyline GTR. Uh, I don't know which one that is but they're both old Nissans. This is got an R type right. So on um especially one in the um, background there. Sixty years of skylines. Well I don't think that's sixty years old, but it does look like a maybe a nineteen sixties car perhaps. Uh so you know they're gonna be slow with no grip, you would you would think, but when um we had the old BMW 3 litre, not the homage one, the old one. Uh, that's actually quite a nice little car to drive. Some of the old ones are quite good to drive, some of them are terrible, but if it's like the old BMW, that'd be, that'd be right. Limit time series, so you compete in two limit time series, so they're putting out yet again the BMW homage which is a, another nice car, but again it's going to cost lots and lots of gold and racing dollars to um, complete that old thing. And also one of the most used cars on the whole game, the Nissan Nismo. Brilliant, brilliant car. If you get, you know, there's many different things like time trials, endurance racing, that would be the pick. The pick car for virtually everybody. So if there was a, an event from so they come up with and it was a hundred laps somewhere and you had to pick one car hundred laps at Le Mans for argument's sake you pick one car that is the car 90% of people would pick brilliant car again it's going to cost you a lot of um, gold and racing dollars though exclusive series which means you have the car fully upgraded is the Ferrari F14 uh, best Formula One car on this game to drive? I would say uh, mine is fully upgraded already, but um, you need to fully upgrade that. And I think the last engine upgrade was about 400 and something gold, I think. Uh, again, very, very expensive. Hope you enjoyed this update. Now, for people like me that have got all the cars and stuff, there's not really much here apart from the Koenigsegg one, a couple of old Nissans which I'm never going to drive, uh, but it does give me some uh, series and stuff I haven't done, obviously, and it'll put my progress back down to whatever 80% or something. So it gives me some new things to race, but all I'm going to be doing is just racing a different car around the same old track shit again. Uh, but for those of you who haven't got the cars, there's some right good goodies to be had.
So view new cars. Surprise, surprise, a little bit of a um, game assets as always. Right, so on there, now the Agera R I think does 450, so this looks like, and it's about that sort of grip. Uh, no, sorry, Regera I'm thinking of does 450, doesn't it? The Agera R does 445 roughly, and this is at base, so I'm guessing this is going to be better than all of them. So this is completing the one on one, they're going to call that, so obviously it'll be. If that is open, I'll be jumping on the next pretty, pretty soon. Uh, right, that's actually got very, very good grip. Very good grip. Skyline GTR. Right, this one is going to be called Unleash the Beast. I don't know anything about this, but that, they look like they, they shouldn't be fast, don't they? But they just are. So nothing... Obviously special to look at. No, I don't know that car, and I'm quite surprised really that when you get, you know, when we all ever play with these, um, the designs and liveries and stuff, that I've not seen one of them. Now, if it's that famous, you'd think when you look on Google and stuff to, you know, look at these these liveries to try and copy and put them on your card you've already got that that would have come up I don't remember it seeing that at all surprise how much uh, how good that grip is for what looks quite a basic level car now that looks typical that is shocking grip shocking top speed acceleration well it hasn't got any 7.9 I reckon if you got Usain Bolt and a couple of his relay team out the back and pushed you I reckon that might beat 7.9 you know that is slow isn't it right so no one is going to get excited of winning that so quite often when they do this the car that on paper looks hideous and when you look at it you think that's even uglier than what it says on paperwork they tend to be fun to drive, so it's um, it's quite weird how they do it. The cars you think are going to be terrible tend to be quite good, and the ones that look absolutely fantastic are often horrible. So it's um, you never say never, really, with this. Uh, anyway, so I'm going to have a look at this um, what that sound. Well, they've got a picture there of an FXX and a Mustang. Complete up to three special events. They are the um, GTE there on the left is the that was um it said was available, but the other two was the Huracan and what was the other one? I think the other one, Wysak package. But now they changed the picture, so. Flashback, right, so it looks like there's all of these here. Right, so rewards 100. Can I get off of that? Right, so you get up to, if you want to do this whole thing, it's a 10 day event for the GTE, you get 100 gold back. So obviously, if you haven't got it, it's going to cost you a fortune. Why is that package? And Huracan, so why did it show me a picture of the FXX? Well, this one you can start already. Well, so I'll be starting that one in a minute, and it's um, uh, what time is it? Here? Twenty to eleven. So if it's one of them on the old ones where you get stages, I'll be able to get onto stage two. Stage two um, in an hour's time, if it is that. I'm just looking at this where it says flashback events. Once you start an event, the others are locked until it's finished. Right, so if you go on to that, then, oh, so I'm not going to obviously start that because I want to get onto that Koenigsegg one because I haven't got that. I've got all these other cars. 
I've already recorded all of the videos for all of these three cars Lions of Leipzig and the 500 and whatever the other one was uh, they're already um, I've already recorded them so if you need uh, stage one, go one, whichever one you need on them I've already got to just search my channel for that and uh, you'll see the corresponding video for it anyway uh, so I'm going to go into that Koenigsegg I'm not going to open that coast that blocks the Koenigsegg from being open uh, and I'll record that one as always uh, shortly so if you haven't got the um, update go on to the app store whether that's iOS or uh, Google and type in Real Racing 3 there'll be an icon there so an update uh, let me know what you think of the update some really good cars there if you've not already got them uh, but it's going to be very very expensive there is a lot of gold and a lot of racing dollars uh, this is going to cost you if you want to go for obviously for all of them maybe you're only going to go for one or two cars if that's the case what ones will you be going for uh, let me know in the comments good luck and i'll see you on the uh, Koenigsegg shortly cheers